Imagine a world where desperation drives you into a deadly game. In Squid Game, 456 participants all drowning in debt are lured by the promise of W45. Six billion, around 38 million are. However, the stakes are higher than they could ever imagine. Losing a game results in death. Chong Gi-hoon, a man on the brink of financial collapse, receives a mysterious card offering a chance at the colossal prize. Grasping at straws, he enters the competition. Unaware of the nightmarish ordeal that awaits, participants are isolated on a remote island, forced to play Korean children's games with lethal consequences. The brutality begins with red light, green light, where motion during red light means being fatally shot. The seemingly innocuous honeycomb requires meticulous precision to avoid a fatal mistake. Games of sheer strength like tug of war end with the losing team plummeting to their deaths. As the games progress, alliances are formed and broken. The sheer brutality of Marble's forces. Participants to outwit or deceive their partners. The glass bridge tests both luck and nerve, with each misstep proving fatal. With each deadly round, the number of survivors dwindles, forcing gut-wrenching decisions. By the final game, the original Squid Game, only one player survives. Gihun wins the ultimate prize, but is scarred by the trauma and deaths he witnessed. The shocking revelation that the game's creator, Oh Il Nam, participated for his own twisted pleasure adds another layer of horror. In the aftermath, despite his victory, Gihun is haunted by guilt and trauma. His final mission becomes uncovering the dark truth behind these games. Determined to prevent further exploitation of the desperate, Squid Game delves deep into themes of economic disparity, human desperation, and the dark side of capitalism, captivating audiences worldwide.